Hello everyone, my name is Kirkwood Hines. I'm an Applications Engineer with Hawkridge Systems. Today I'd like to show you how to move files around on our computers without breaking any references that assemblies might contain or maybe drawings. So we have an assembly here that right now has some broken at references. So we're getting the message unable to locate the file uh, in the path designated within the assembly. Now if you just have one person working on an assembly, it's easy enough for them to know where they've moved the file and just browse out uh, to that new location for the file and hit open. It's going to update those references and fix your assembly as soon as you've hit saved. So if you have multiple people working on assembly though and files move, uh, it can be fairly difficult for the second person to locate those files uh, if there's a lack of communication. So a better way, or the best practice uh, method of moving files around on your computer is to use SolidWorks Explorer. So this will come with any installation of SolidWorks. And it functions just like Windows Explorer. So we're able to browse out to the locations of all our files, but it gives us some particularly useful options when it comes to SolidWorks files. So here we have our pedal axle and pedal cup that we want to move. Now if I just double click on those, I'm able to see all the custom properties I may have added, any references those files are making, but I'm also able to see where the file is currently being used at. So it's currently only being used in our pedal assembly. Now if I want to move this file to a new location and keep this reference, all I need to do is left click on the file and go to SolidWorks Move here at the end. This allows me to specify a new location and choose if I want to update the references that are uh, currently being made to this file. So we do want to do that. And it's going to move it to the new location and update those references within the assembly. Now an easier way to access uh, this SolidWorks Move option is to just right click on the file you want to move, look for the SolidWorks Flyout menu, and then go to move. It's going to perform the exact same option uh, without having to navigate to SolidWorks Explorer. So we can just browse out for the file we want to move it to. Hit OK. And we do want to update that reference. So I'll hit OK again. It's going to move that file. And if we open up our pedal assembly again, see that those file locations are now updated. If you ever want to review the file locations that an assembly uh, is currently looking at, you can go up to, to File, Find References. So this displays all the folders uh, and all the parts that this assembly is currently referencing. So it's a good tool to have in your arsenal. So I hope you found this tip useful. For more tricks and tips like this, please subscribe to the Hawkridge Systems YouTube channel. Thank you for watching.